Now this is a change of location from when we last played three. We are in my house now, playing four... On the outskirts of Mordor. Yes, <laughs> in Sauron. <laughs> uh, in Sauron, right then. Basically, we're going to be playing four, five, six, Tag HD and Tag 2 Prologue. This is the day before it's Tekken, Tekken Tag... It's Tekken Eve. Yes, <laughs> Tekken Eve. Um, unless you're American, in which you've had it for like a day in, or two. It's like three days by tomorrow, I think. Also, them shoppers don't even care. <laughs> They're just like, yeah, um, As you can see, Glyn is playing uh, Tekken 4 at the moment. Unfortunately, because I only have one PS2 controller, we've kind of got to take it in turns or whatever. Um, but you know, that's Back manageable. If, oh, yeah. if the off chance, if the very rare chance I manage to not lose in this, then one of you can just go through, start off on five then. Yes. Mm -hmm. Or whatever, whatever you want to do. Actually. Um, right, okay, so let's start with Memories of Four then, because, uh... What's one of those one I got really excited for? Because I played two, like, so much as a kid. And I saw four on the PS2, I was like, Dad, we have to get Tekken 4! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Did you play a lot of it? Was it like oh, a, oh, um... I know I like this game. I see. But then I didn't play it for ages, and so now I'm playing it again, and all like, ah. Oh. Yeah, I know what you mean. Uh, Glyn, what was your, like, memory of 4? Back in the days where PlayStation 2 games cost, like, 40 quid. Oh, God, <laughs> oh, God yeah. yeah. Uh, I didn't really know this was coming out, apart from the one time I played it in London in arcade, and that's how I found out Kazuya was back, and I was really happy. Oh. I managed to beat my uncle on that, and then, like, a year later, it was like my birthday. I can't remember how old I was, but I basically went to Woolworths. Yes, Woolworths again. <laughs> and uh, found out that it was there for about 45 quid. I basically nagged Dad to get it. I'm assuming it was basically a present, so I just went with it. Oh, and I basically played the hell out of it. I see. I think the only other game I played was like Digimon Rumble Arena. <laughs> so basically both fighting games. I found out about Tekken Fold the same way as Glyn in, uh, in our arcade. I just saw it. I was like, wait, what's this intro? This is people with guns. Wait a minute, hang on, that looks like Kazuya. I was, just, I was like, just like, hang on, Tekken 4. <laughs> Oh, yeah. combat. oh, combat! Can't wait to use it tomorrow. Yeah, personally speaking, a better character than Mokujin. Oh. I, do, I, I just love combat. Mainly because he was made by me. Oh, yeah. Was there a reason why they didn't have Mokujin in 4? Probably because uh, they wanted to try it. Yeah. I don't think mm. there was a reason he just wanted to Oh, right. Because, um. Because I, I think I got Tekken 4 and it's like on sale because I got the platinum version. Um, so I wasn't like. I was hyped for it, but I never got it, if you know what I mean, it's like... <laughs> but then when I did get it, you know, I played Lords and stuff, and... Uh, I think this is the first Tekken where, like, I took it really seriously. Yeah, like, story-wise, I was like, fuck, fuck, shit's going down in this game. Yeah, it's like, 3 was, like, fun and a fighting game. It's like, oh yeah, it has a story. But this one's like, wait, I need to complete the story to see the ending. Two, huh. two is when the story properly starts kicking in. Yeah. I didn't really notice it much in TV. No. This one I don't That's think. because this had like prologues and stuff like that, wasn't it? Was that Lee's oh, fighting right. style? Yeah, it is. Yes, there it was. Yeah, that sort of thing. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> but yeah, it's uh. This felt a bit different to Tekken 3, mine. It was more like darker. Oh, oh, oh Steve. Darker. Yeah, okay. Before he got his horrible accent. Oh. The introduction yeah, of Steve. Dare I say it was this game slightly more. Some points more gothic, no? Mm. I yeah, yeah. I see what you mean. It, it is a lot of a darker story as well. Yeah. Especially the gin and the zoos. Yeah. Oh god, yeah. <laughs> it's run out of battery. No. I love this stage because I think you can like knock people you can, over. I was trying to love this one as well. The ending. <laughs> it's so huge. wrong. Look at it. What's now? Ew, ew. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Oh yeah, the end. Yeah, the end ending was really interesting with the whole devil thing and like, oh, I'm taking off. Yeah, like, I, I, I like how Tekken 5's intro is literally where Jin's tank finishes. Yeah. Probably seconds afterwards. And then, well, I'm assuming all of you watching this aren't going to consider it a spoiler, but and then in five, I didn't do many like of the stories. I just like played a lot of, like, just arcade mode, but, like... That is a spoiler. You just spoiled how you played the game. <laughs> I, I am appalled. But then, I, appalled. I unlocked Heihachi from playing it, rather than from, like, oh, completing yeah. so. And I was like, Heihachi's he dead. dead. I was like, he's dead? Why am I Heihachi? <laughs> Hang on. Yeah, then I played the story again. I was like, oh, yeah. Oh, 
Yeah, um, this is, it's a fairly nice looking game, I mean, even though it's not horrible to look at. It's, it's, not it's the best it's, in terms of, it's arguably better looking than Tag, but that's been debated yeah. for years. Some people reckon Tag looks better. I don't know, I think it looks better than Tag. Yeah. No, I remember debating it with you about it, like, I was like, I was like, no, Tag's better than but, uh, I don't know. So, who is your favourite character in this, Tim? Violet, well, Violet slash Lee. Ah, uh, yes, the huge... No, that's a spoiler. <gasps> oh, no, Violet's Lee! You don't know about it until you get to the end. Even though the fight itself is rather obvious. So, was yours possibly, uh, Horang, Glyn? Um, still for fighting Horang, yeah, but I think... Jin was amazing for his hoodie. Yeah. Oh, yes, Jin's hoodie. This, this is probably his most, dare I say, emo Tekken. Well, yeah. well, but my favourite yeah. character in this had my favourite character in this had to be Kazuya because of his badass return, even though it was all in vain, kind of. Yeah. I think mine in this was Combot. I know it's oh, like yeah, Combot win. Horrible he, mention. He didn't really like have much of it. Well, the story was just like oh, it's crazy, but. Oh right. Oh wow. Fight Labs about. Oh well, yeah. Okay, yeah, that's true. Um, but yeah, it's like I don't know. I just loved Combot for like his design and stuff. Yeah, it's really awesome about combat. It's, uh... And when he goes, like, crazy at the end, and oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. that's just cool. Yeah, it's, uh... Right, we leave it there. Unless... Oh, oh wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, oh, oh. You might love this. Oh. Fan service, people. Ah! <laughs> oh. Remember that time when, uh, hey, have you decided to come up with a huge uh. happy? Ah! <laughs> oh God! Oh. I'm sorry, viewers. Like I'm sorry, viewers. Oh, look at that! Oh, oh. oh yeah, and his oh. ass. There we go. Ew. Ew. He actually sounded a bit like Jabba the Hutt there. Ew. Well, this camera recognises oh. he has a face. You were just dancing to him. <laughs> yeah, I was. You can do that. <laughs> I can just dance to it. We might as well film this because why not? There's one more fight after this, but you can film if you want. Yeah, I might as well. Make it worthwhile watching, you know. Yeah, you've got to see the sub. What do you want? What do you want? Do you want? Oh, bollocks. I always assumed when I first saw this stage, like the first time I got to it, before Heihachi came out, I thought it'd be like King. <laughs> I was like, huh, oh, it's a stadium, okay, cool. Maybe it's this music like tag too, and I'm really happy with it. Hmm. Oh, I do like this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is there a couple of trailers for it as well? Yeah. Do you want to so. see this or don't want me to skip it? Um, it's basically just like, I don't know what to do, I've left. Uh, paraphrase it. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it now, but I don't want to talk about it. Basically, that. Yeah. Okay. Oh, God, here we go. Where? Prepare. You're finally here. So, what do you want? He kind of does a line as well. It's a tournament. I'll take you on right here, right now. There's no reason to fight. What no. is that accent? It's Japanese. Why? Well, it's English. Like, ah! It doesn't, even, it doesn't even sound very English either. Right, Harang is Korean. Yeah. He's Korean, Tekken he people. He's American. Mind you, Tekken 5 corrects that. Yeah, okay. He's all Korean in that. And they actually translate what he's saying. Yeah. Oh, oh, that hoodie. I would genuinely wear that hoodie oh, and those it trousers. His hoodie came off as well. I don't know how bad is this. Boom! <laughs> I love the music transition as well. It never did this in any other game. Ow. Look at that guy. He's all around class. He has punches. And I believe you can run into one of these pillars and kill yourself. <laughs> Awesome. It's like, oh, it does loads of damage, or something like that. Wow, that would have been awesome if finished it with that, oh well. 
I'll do that instead. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that works. Right, before I go, were there any um, extras or Easter eggs or like secrets in Tekken 4 you can think of? Um... Apart from Miharu. If you, <laughs> if you count the statue stage where it plays old Tekken 2 music, hmm. besides that, I don't think anything else. Was there a Tekken Force mode? Yeah. This, yeah. is, this was the second game in Did that actually go anywhere? Because I don't think I played much yeah. of it. It had like four stages, and the third stage had Kazuya's Tekken 2 arcade theme in it. Yeah. And he fought Kazuya at the end, obviously. And it was quite good. But besides that, yeah. Yeah, I was going to say, you didn't like unlock anything, or? Um, no. He didn't unlock anything with it. It was just fun. It's a really good ending, this. I like Karang's ending. Somehow they don't get shot. Through a car. They, they, yeah. They've like been to the stormtroopers like school. Ship. Yeah, definitely. I love Jin and Harang's like team up kind of thing here. Yeah. Well, if you wonder why they just don't walk behind the car and just go. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they're pretty tough. Also, look how many bullets are going off behind them. Look at the smile. Look at the smile. Aww. I love them. Are they supposed to be the Korean military? Oh my god, I'm totally shipping them. <laughs> Hang on, aren't they supposed to be the, are they yeah. supposed to be the Korean military? <laughs> They're not right. very good, are they? And they speak proper oh, English. I don't know. Oh yeah, that too. Okay, well, I'll leave it there then, unless there's anything particular. Good game, underrated. <laughs> Yeah, I, I really like Tekken 4. I mean, yeah. it's not the best Tekken, but, it is, yeah. but equally, in its own right, it's a good game. Yeah. We are now playing Tekken 5, as you can tell by the stage and Devil Jin. Being cheap as, as usual. Well, yes. Ah. <laughs> That's Tim's right. Well, actually, this is the rendition they made after Tim sang it's, it to it's them. It's true, it's true. I pitched it, they loved it, they used it. This may be the garden stage. No, as long as from here on in, it's not there. Oh, what well, you know? <laughs> it's the one bit of story he has. That's a bit harsh. This is Jin Pachi. Kill people from bad manners. I remember you talking about this, Tim. It was fun. So, anyway, right. Let's go through uh, people's memories of Five. Uh, Tim? Five's quite recent. When did you buy Windows 5 out? When did I go to high-pitched? Four, five years ago? Four, five years ago, yeah, maybe four, five So, like, did you buy it when it came out? Probably, or? yeah, I think I did. What the hell? So, um, did you play a lot of it, or...? I, I bummed it for ages. I had to, like, you know, get my Lee to the best rank ever. Ah. Uh, I think I got him pretty <coughs> far, but then I gave up because I got more. Did you beat the Berserker? <coughs> did you beat my Devil's in Berserker? <laughs> I think I got him roughly, like... Because I kept doing this to every person. Um, what was I going to say? So, Glyn, what was your memories? Did you get this when it came out? Uh, not when it came out, for some odd reason. Uh, <coughs> I ended up pretty much bumming it when Tim had it. I see. Um, I had most of the end of the spot because I, for some reason I decided to screw it. I'll watch all of them because I don't know when I'll get yeah. it. Typically, about a month later, I got it for my birthday. Ah. So, and then I basically just played the hell out of it. And, yeah, I see. It's pretty fun. Plus, uh, the history mode is quite awesome. Hmm. I was just so happy that they brought so many people back in. Oh yeah, so was I. After four, I was like, oh, please give us some more people back. It's more colourful. Yeah, four was sort of fairly plainish, but this is very, like the graphics and stuff are pretty good. Yeah. I mean, I realise you know it's a PS2 game, so it's not going to look amazing, but it's pretty good. It's good for a PS2. Game. Yeah, but even no, it's like it's one of the best looking ones. Um, my my memory of it was I randomly walked into PC World as my brother once <laughs> and like realised he was out I, I like remembered I was really like hyped for it for months I was like oh it's coming out soon totally forgot so it was on sale and bought it like that day this uh it was a really I really enjoyed it it's like, oh, but, but come on that was like a one frame off Look at that, one frame. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I got uh, I got really annoyed by Jin Pachi, so I didn't play that much of five. Um but I did play a lot of Dark Resurrection. But he's in that as well. That, that, that shit makes no sense. Well no, but in Dark Resurrection he was fairer, he was nerfed a bit. Oh, okay, well, yeah. I thought he was anyway, because like ridiculously annoying. 
In this one, he's a lot harder I than the. Uh, my dark resurrection. What? Uh, you. I think James bought it off you. Then he gave it to me. Oh yeah. Look at that. Mine is literally down in that. So the, the dark there. resurrection you have is mine. I think so. Yeah. Well, that's nice. Weird. But yeah, um, Dark Resurrection I spent so long on. Um, um, Shit's going down so. Uh, uh, remember Dark Resurrection had a weird mode, you could like buy their movies. Oh yeah, if you just couldn't be asked to go through it. But like, I don't know, I didn't like that, it was like, no, I don't think I've earned it. What the hell is he doing here? He's turning into Gorilla Devil Jin. I just think he's picking up. Devil Jin did evolve into <laughs> Gorilla Devil Jin. Mom. <laughs> Gorilla Jin. Mom. Oh shit, son. Very uh, chaos esque. So, who was your favourite character? Do I need to ask Lynn? Do I need to ask who your favourite character in this was? Uh, Devil Jin. <laughs> yes. Uh, Tim? Yeah, Lee, of course. I like most characters in this. It's just if I had to pick one, you know. I think I got pretty into like Marduk in this weirdly. Yeah, Marduk. Gerardo, we love you. <laughs> um, but like King as well, kind of like I really picked up my King play. Um, well, that's not a bum in this game. There was someone else I bummed in this game. Oh yeah, Kazuya. Uh, Kazuya's all like, I'm Kazuya, yeah. We... I can I can do Kazuya's moves better with like that, you know, proper yeah. PlayStation as I'm trying to think of um, who else I was, but. I know, I'm Feng. Feng, I loved Feng. I could get into him much. He's just there anyway. Yeah, he can, he's alright, but not. He was. I, I liked him because, like, if you learnt a few, like, stances and stuff, like, he was really powerful. And he could do it from the standing position. You didn't have to, like, run forward and stuff. Oh. Just go, like, do, do, do. Boom! But, uh, yeah. So, um. Rara. Extra features. There was the museum history mode thingy with Tekken that, that one, devil within. one, two, and three. Ooh. Oh yeah, the Devil Within adventure mode thing. Which I thought was quite good. Yeah, yeah. I, I quite liked it. Um, Dandy mix. Yeah, exactly. Then um, after this, can we just go on the first stage just to hear yeah. the music? Yeah. Then it's what, not on the sound test at all. What else was there? Um, I think. Um, there's, a, there's a main one. Uh, was the first one with the ranking system thing. Yeah. Oh yeah, the ranking was like Q, the ranking system, down. Yeah. Uh, customization, obviously. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's the first one with money at all, isn't it? Actually, yeah. yeah. But I'm looking at Tai 2 and Tekka 6 now and you've seen how far that's expanded. Yeah. It, it's impressive really, because 5 introduced a lot of things to the series. Yeah. Um, you know. 5 was the last one with a decent Tekken 4 style mode. Hmm. Since I didn't really like six as well. I don't like how six relied on it to get money. And it relied on it, and like items as well really pissed me off because it went from you, looking you, you, good. You make a guy look retarded just so he can be powerful. Yeah. It's um oh I remember I really That's hated what that I aspect. About time two, there's slots. It's not just press a button, it's just costume, it's just if you want that costume, just select that one and you've got it. What was in like It's like it's like you press one of the buttons on mm. the select screen then it Show that you can have it like ten slots. You can pick one. Oh. And, yeah. Oh, alright. So you can like make so it's so, it's so, ten different variations. Yeah. Like, so, oh, so, right. so you don't like press a button and hope you pick the right button for that customization. Ah. Like how I when I press X, hoping oh I hope I get devil's customization. No. Yeah. It's like ten slots. And you can see you can see what one. You can press that and yeah. If we that makes sense. if we skip this now, we'll show a bit of. Uh, it's pretty much over. Okay. We'll show a bit of devil within. This is the last checking game that I properly sat through the credits for because music's awesome. But Tag 2 might be the beginning of that. Yeah, I might just do it again. Hmm. Namco. We love you, Namco. We do. I, just, I suppose Nam Bandai Namco or Namco Bandai as well. But Namco was there since the beginning, so I'm there. Okay, but yeah, um. The roster as well was a lot bigger in this than for. And we're back! Devil within. Ah. Title screen. No, listen to this. Listen to this. <gasps> My lord. We can make a Cloverfield kind of thing. <laughs> and then just... <laughs> I have to do easy on this. I'm, I'm not very it's good. Hard. Hard. That's what she said. Just, just listen to this music. Blah, 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 blah. This is going in my Tekken tunes. 
Yes, this was the uh, gin centered adventure mode. Of coolness. I've played some ages. Yes. Did you get money from this? Uh, I can't no, remember. I think so. I can't remember. Maybe a little bit. Uh, I think. Didn't you get like bonuses you, 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 or something you, you at the can, end? You can unlock one or two items. Yeah, but the specially item things. Oh, I've got yeah. quite a lot of them actually. How do you, how do, you do the stop? That's how you do it. No, I didn't figure that out for ages and stopped playing because I couldn't get through the floor. <laughs> then one day, just randomly realised, wait, you can do ground. Hang on. Yeah, it's, it's like it works out as a fairly decent like adventure mode in itself, really, without being yeah. anything to do with tech and. So not so many mini games. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, we'll leave it here, um, unless anyone has any other things to say about Tekken 5. Good comeback. <laughs> yeah, well, so I need to find out if the whole Anna Lee thing is canon. I'll have to do that after this. Oh, right, yes. The Anna... I'm sure, I'm sure it is. Maybe. Anyway, we'll leave it there for now. Do something cool, Glenn. I kind of can't. I haven't got Devil Team with me yet. Uh, um, uh... Uh, uh, there you go. Hey, well, this is uh, Tekken 6 now we're playing. Random, random, random. Anna. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um. Okay. Well. I don't yeah. have any memories of this because we only have it for PSP, and uh -huh. I only played that for like five minutes. Right. Okay. So Tim doesn't have very fond memories from when he was ten or anything. <laughs> when I was ten, and this game wasn't even in development. Yeah, good times. Um. Yeah, Glenn, your memories of this. Uh, I remember being extremely gutted because Play.com was screwed up in my order. Oh. So I ended up using Shop 2 for the first time ever. Noticed they had the game in stock, and I ended up getting the game like a day after the Americans got it. Oh, oh. my god! So that was like two days before the Europeans were going to get it, and I basically played the hell out of it. If, I it, see. Wasn't, if it wasn't for Elisa, I would have got Scenario Camp being done like the same day. <laughs> I see. Um, well, my memory was just, I think, like, fuck, I can't even remember where I bought it. I think it was in, like, game. I don't think I pre-ordered it or anything. I just, like, no, for Christmas, that's it. I wanted it for Christmas, so I got it. Um, I did story mode, but that's about it, really. Like, um, you know, the campaign mode. That was yeah. about it. I didn't play much arcade, to be honest. I didn't even know they bought all the PSP versions when I saw oh, it in the shop. I was like, beat me. I, I beat you up. as Anna. I got beaten up by a prostitute. Yeah, that's wow. all. Wow. Odd times all around. Okay, that's just not odd. I may actually play some more Tekken 6 tonight, just like... Oh, and now I'm Nina. <laughs> oh, yes, Hidden Retreat. The only stage you can get on random. Have you seen this stage before, Tim? Nope. You'll love it. Hidden Retreat. Um, I don't think I have either. Is it like a retreat that's hidden? <laughs> Oh! We're fighting in wheels! <laughs> Are you sure this is only on random? Yeah, it's random only. That's a bit weird. This uh -huh. like... Brilliant. <laughs> Look at the sheep! This is so I, cute! I love this stage. I've been in it a few times. Like, arcades or whatever. I love the song to it. This is brilliant! Oh, oh also, there? there's that woman man guy. Uh, um, man. Not, woman not, man guy. Not right? Alex or whatever, is it? You know the. Oh, I know the one you're talking about. The one with the like short blonde hair who I thought was a guy. Leo. Leo, yeah. Leo's confirmed for being a girl, though, yeah, right? Yeah, there's a picture of Leo in a bikini, so people reference him. Well, yeah, there's also pictures of Heihachi in a bikini, that doesn't yeah. really make any difference. Wait, Heihachi confirmed <laughs> for girl? Defo. The... But yeah, um... How is Nina in this? She doesn't look her age. She's probably like 50, isn't she? But yeah, um, Tekken 6. Oh. Your favourite character, Glyn? Do I need to ask? <laughs> no. Devil Jin. Um, mine is Lars. I fucking love Lars. It's... I'm thinking of learning him in uh, Tai 2, because he looks quite good. He is... 
damn good. I really love Lars. His fighting style and everything. After this, I may have a go if you don't mind. Have, uh... Yeah, I do mind, okay? <laughs> God. But yeah. Um, not, much, not much else to say about 6, really, is there? Um, Otherwise, it's a good game. Ending's a bit meh. Yeah. I need to do the endings, actually, you know, see them and stuff. Um, Damn perfect. Yeah, okay, well, that's it for now. Uh, we'll see you on Prologue.